This is breaking news now from today's TMJ4. It's a busy afternoon and we begin with breaking news out of Milwaukee County. David Clark at 1159 tonight will no longer be county sheriff. The county clerk confirmed to me Clark submitted his resignation at 317 this afternoon. Let's go to George Millay, who has the latest developments from the newsroom. George. Yeah, well, Clark's resignation confirmed shortly after three this afternoon, as you said, by you, Steve. That's when Milwaukee County Clerk George Christensen received the firebrand cowboy hat wearing lawman's official letter of resignation. So that's what we know. What we don't know is what Clark plans to do when he leaves office at midnight. Clark, who built a nationwide following among conservatives with his provocative social media presence and early backing of Donald Trump, announced he was leaving once before this year. That, of course, was in the spring when the sheriff, known for the chestnut quarter horse he rides in parades, as well as for the deaths of prisoners in the county lockup, told conservative radio host Vicki McKenna he would be joining the Department of Homeland Security. Well, after that announcement, the Department of Homeland Security repeatedly refused to confirm Clark's revelation, reporting only that such an appointment would have to be made by the Secretary of Homeland Security, then John Kelly, and that no such an appointment had been made. Uh, whatever the sheriff does next, he will clearly remain a darling of the political right. His consistent support for the president's crackdown on illegal immigration, his support for patrolling of Muslim neighborhoods, and his insults of fellow public officials have, arguably, made him one of the most polarizing figures in Wisconsin politics. We will keep you posted on this breaking news throughout our broadcast day and online. For now, I'm George Mallet in the newsroom. Shannon, Steve, back to you. All right. Thank you, George.